Okay, hey guys, how you doing? How you doing? How you doing? Uh, May, May, February the 1st, Craig-centric Hanoi coronavirus update. I didn't get very much done today. I had some alcohol last night. Yes, I did, and that put me into one or two gears down today. Smooth move, Craig, but it's Saturday. Anyway, what did I do? Well, so I hit the street. What did I get done today? I didn't get a lot. I did find these um, very nice looking Japanese swim goggles. There we go. They're really tight, so they, <laughs> but uh, yeah, we got the uh, C. So they're either they're at least Japanese labeled. So someone at least took the time to make them look Japanese. Oof, God, Craig, you gotta loosen that sucker up, right? Okay, so you got that. And I couldn't find my welding respirator. I checked a bunch of welding supply stores, and it's just like, uh, no, I have, no, I have. Um, no, the answer is no, I have. Sorry, or no, I have. Try that way. No, that's not how it works here. <laughs> no, I have. I did find these Eco Mask PM two point five. It's the next level up. It's got the little thing on the little, little separate bumpy thing. Anyway. But I really want that respirator. I would feel better if I did. Uh, my contact here should have said to me, oh, later on, after I thought I was so smart doing what the, what the answer box suggested, he said, oh, yeah, well, oh, workplace protective gear? Yeah, that's on this street here. <clears throat> All right, fine. So <laughs> that's the street I'm going to. Tomorrow, Sunday, I'm sure they're closed. But I'll go on Monday. Okay. Uh, the so Okay, so like at the root chakra, I got that going on. And up here, we have the latest news, fake, maybe, I don't know, neither do you, uh, going through about how, having to do with the, the prevalence of a certain enzyme in the lungs, and that enzyme being apparently from the genomic wizardry going on, none of which I can debunk. Um, that, 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 it, that appears to be the thing that fits to the, oh, get into your, get into you. It goes to this thing that's more prevalent in Chinese people. Well, actually, Japanese people even more so, and then I guess I guess Korea is kind of between, if you know what I mean. But uh, and then when it comes to like, you got the outer sinosphere here. I don't. When it comes down to like the tiosphere, I have no idea. Um, big if true. Can I prove it's true? No. But big if true. And, you know, if true, um, in, in the Bayesian sense, because I, I, can't, I can't ever come to a place of confidence that I know it's true, but if it were, then that would mean that I'm at much less risk of being very ill. You get the flu, you don't die. You get the flu, you don't go to the hospital. You get the, you know... Because I've got like you know, one fifth as many of these little thingy dings as uh, Chinese fellas do. Chinese fellas have way more than Chinese women. And up in China, you see the uh, the ratio is like between two, yeah, between two to one and three to one that the deaths are men up in China right now. That's another little factoid that's leaning. You know, so you got the. You got the death statistics over here, and then you got this genomic wizardry going over here, and at least in this way, they're kind of meeting in the middle, you know. But it is early days. So, you know, the, you know in the immediate, you know, next five minutes sense, that's good news for me. But that doesn't help me at all, being stuck in a country full of broke, hungry, sick, and scared people, duh. Uh, not a very few of whom I can actually talk to. I mean, come on, Craig, right? There's that. And then also, maybe that means I can, I don't know, does that mean I can carry it longer? Does that mean that I can go through more time? Does that mean it takes me longer when I'm, since my body doesn't react as strong? Does that mean I've got a longer period of time when I can infect other people? I'm making this up. What I'm getting at is that I realize now, you know, everywhere I've gone, this whole trip, everywhere I've gone, you know, when I come up over that hill on my bicycle, nobody has ever seen me coming and had a reason to think, uh-oh, 
See what I mean? No one's ever seen me come in and go, uh-oh. That's never been part of the experience, even for one minute. Um, if I had bigger muscles and a stronger chin, maybe you'd be, uh, okay, is Susie back from high school? She's in the house? Okay, hi. You know, that's as worse as it could be. But uh, that, you know, so it's like, okay, hmm, but now there's that element. There could be that element. Because if I've heard about this, true or not, if I've heard about this, they're going to hear about it. And what does, whoa, what is that going to, oh, I don't know. So, you know, this, this is all real time. And I'm definitely, I'm bargaining here. I, this, is, this is pure bargaining phase. I'm quite sure, most likely, the acceptance phase at the end of this morning process is going back to the States and finding a damn job and starting over. What I'm still trying to bargain for, though, is uh, can, I t can I still talk myself into going to Russia where they've only had one case and they've got strong borders and all that, but their medicine is only so-so and I can't talk to people. My money's good, you know, and I'm nice to everybody, but I can't really talk to people. Not really. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Right. Ugh! Yeah, and then there's, you know, okay, fine. There's, uh, there's Australia, freaking expensive, and New Zealand, freaking expensive, but probably also kind of nice and interesting. Yeah. Okay. You know, the, the, there are some really affordable English-speaking countries I've been to called South Africa, Namibia, Botswana, but uh, we haven't found out whether this virus um, is bad for Africans yet. We don't know. If it's bad for Africans, if it's as bad or even nearly as bad for African people as it is for Chinese people, then holy shit. Excuse me, cussing again, but you can see why, right? Yeah, especially in South Africa, all those townships, all those, just a bunch of porta potties around the edge being the only place to go to the bathroom. I mean, you know what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying. Right. So that's. That's where I'm at. That's where I'm at. Sensible thing is, Craig, get your flight suit, pack your crap, go back to the States, deal with it. Okay. And then I'm just still trying to bargain my way into something else. V shall Z. If that, if I can get back into believing that that can work out, or if a few days later I just think it's the dumbest thing, I, dumbest idea ever. That's the update. Yep, this is real time, folks. Always a pleasure. Catch you later. Oh, yeah. Fantastic. Wait, uh -huh. yet. Chipmunk the mic? Ah, that's right. Oh, yes, yes. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, Gamun. Gamun Ba. Yeah, all right. And then, my man shows up with a, with a bottle opener, a wine bottle opener. See, I had bought this bottle of wine from, um, that was from uh, Da Lot. Da Lot. D A space L A T. You can find it in your answer box. And it's a uh, particularly scenic and like it's southern, but it's mountainous and all misty and, and cool and beautiful. And they grow the, the fruits and the vegetables there and the Viet's are into their fruits and their vegetables. And also, very special, they grow the wine. They grow the grapes, like the wine there. And that's like, that is it. Like, yo, know, Vietnam has wine now. Like, ooh, our stuff, right? And so I bought a bottle of that. I had it for a couple of weeks, just sort of sitting around because I had a cork in it. I didn't have a thing. The bike comes with a uh, a bottle opener for beer bottles, actually like soldered onto the frame. That's how RNE Cycles does it. 
But um, no, nah, nah, there's nothing for, I don't have anything for bottles, so I'm, I'm walking around with this thing, ah, damn. But uh, finally today, I went down asking if the manager could help me, and he couldn't. He, he, like, he went to the restaurant that way, went to the restaurant that way. He's going here, he's going there, he's coming back with a screw, and we're, he's putting the screw in with his bare hands, and we're working on it with a, <laughs> with a pair of pliers. Never worked. Fine, okay. That's all right, all right, all right, all right. Came back here, and then a couple hours later, after doing the, yeah, uh, the other manager comes up, knock, knock, knock. He's got, I said, oh, yeah. So he thought he was going to give it to me. I'm like, no, man, shit, come on. And so I get the bottle of wine, and then uh, and I get some, some cups and some glasses, and we go down to the lobby, and, and, and we drink it, and we talk. I mean, talk, you know, mostly acting. He was an engineer, too, so we're in the tribe. And then also uh, the Google Translate's going on here. And uh, we talked about how, oh, yeah, I, how I had seen the sign outside. Two, three. I'm sorry, the picture's reverse because of, anyway. Two, three. It's the 90th, so that's in two days, right? Two days, two, three. February, yeah, February 2nd. That's the uh, coming up anniversary of the 90th. The 90th anniversary of the founding of the Chinese, I'm sorry, the Vietnamese Communist Party and all this. You know, that was, that was Uncle Ho, Ho Chi Minh. It's not Ho Chi Minh, it's Ho Chi Minh. Ho Chi Minh. It's just, you know, him kicking off his thing, right? And of course, that'd be a big thing. And on the TV, remember the TV? They've got these performances and all these operas and stage shows and then the, 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 the little girls in the dresses doing this and the fellas come out and do this and all this, man. It, fine, fine, fine. You know, so we're talking about this, talking about that, talking about where we've been, where we're going, and all that. And uh, I learned from him, and then later came back up here and saw, you know, before going to bed and before uploading to the YouTube, I found uh, that the good news that, well, good news, I mean, okay, Vietnam went from five to six. And crucially, See, here, here's the milestone, okay? So the first two fellas, the Chinese guys, they got sick here. Well, that's, that's pretty bad. That's bad for the brand, <laughs> right? Okay, and then, uh, and then three more guys, they were Vietnamese, that brought the disease down from China. I mean, you know, they're Vietnamese and they're sick. That's bad, okay? So that's like the next level of bad. But today's guy, today's guy, today's new guy, a Vietnamese who caught the Wuhan virus from another Vietnamese. Oh shit! Okay, so this is this is happening within. This is entirely happening within Vietnam, and that's like ah. Okay, so that okay. So Vietnam. So the prime minister is calling you know not just game time, but game time, game time. And so remember that Mong Kai border crossing I was talking about, the major border crossing, there's that highway, that coastal highway, you'll find it on the map, there's that main coastal highway, there would be one, right, in China that goes from uh, Hong Kong and Shenzhen, the Guangzhou and the Guangdong area, if an actual Chinese person were to say that, it'd be terrible, I know, but uh, it's a seriously populated and intense, it's the Pearl River Delta, Pearl River, you, you've heard of that. And that's where it comes down. That's where Hong Kong is. That's where the, the Shenzhen and the Guangdong and all of this action. And it's been that forever. It's a big economic center because that's where the river hits the water. You'll see it. And uh, there's a coastal highway, do, 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 and that's where that coastal highway hits Vietnam. And so that's the major border crossing anyway. And uh, Mr. Prime Minister said, all right, that's it. Not only are there problems coming into Vietnam, but the problems are here and they're within Vietnam, so screw this, no more. We've had it. And so we're halfway celebrating the closure, the perhaps full closure now of the border with China. Now look, if one new guy comes down with it today, that means there's that means there's more guys walking around and giving it to other people. Okay, that does that doesn't mean it's over. It could it could keep it could still keep going. I don't know. Okay, but I'm I'm just happy. All right, and what do they say? Happiness is is making progress, not getting there. But it's like little steps of progress. So I'm I'm happy. He's happy. We're happy that 
the government is taking uh, stronger action to protect the country from the Wuhan China disease. Okay. And you know, six folks, that's still one ten millionth. That's still one ten millionth of the population, so you know, who knows? And I'm kind of, you know, high, a, high on half a bottle of wine. He, he, I bring the wine, you know, we got little teacups and stuff. We get, <laughs> they have a little teapot that really has any tea in it. And little teacups, I start pouring teacups. Oh, great. Blah, 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 blah. And he goes and gets uh, some of these special New Year's cookies and these little uh, chocolate coins. And we're munching on these. And we're talking about Vietnam. We're talking about the world. Talking about this, talking about that. The best we can. Like little little baby toddler conversation, real slow. But fine, it's something. Stuff straight, Craig. Okay. And uh, so that was fine. I'm happy about that. That's all. And so now I'm really sacking it. And tomorrow, it's going to be an internal day, I think. Stuff will be closed. And uh, I'll just tidy up a bit. Get ready for uh, Monday when a lot of, a lot of the, the games begin again. 